Yo, this music. This is Gilgamesh's theme, I think. It's so nice. Stop this. Yo, easy block. Is that how I, um, I should do? It must be. Please get staggered, Gilgamesh. Easy. Uh, have you fireball played? People, we should be using it. Rise and fall. <laughs> well, it's kind of late, but it's fine. Yeah, I'm really low. Come at me. Aggrandize? Oh, he's like, he like magic up or something. The strength up. You can't match this. You can't match best girl. Oh yeah, perfect garden just pressures him. Easy. Dude, I love perfect dodging. Oh, you think just got the guard there? What the heck? AI is not playing around. Just got me. So close. Ooh, man. We got no experience. Is he gonna run away? Dude, I love that Gilgamesh was in this game. What a great choice by the developers. Such a nice addition. Find me the black materia, pal. Predator looks pretty good. Luckily, it wasn't too boring because they only had the only like the first two were kind of on the boring side, like gameplay wise. But in terms of like cutscenes and lore, really nice. Also, we're gonna get another one of these. Ho. We are done. The Black Robes Proto Relic. Alright, well, Nabel is complete. So, yeah. The only region that's not complete. Cosmo Canyon Corral can't be completed. Cosmo could be. We need uh we also need one more side quest in Cosmo. And we need to finish this um side quest here. That's what we're gonna do right now. We're gonna finish up the side quest and yeah. And I'll probably just like let the other stuff sit. I like I want to probably move on the story until the planet will return is what I decided. We'll see what happens though. Oh, you get your hands on that choco grass. I sure did. Well.
Well, well, if it ain't my beloved Choco Grass. This stuff can be one hell of a hassle to gather. Thank goodness I had you to get it for me. Okay, so what are you gonna do with it? <laughs> I suppose you've earned the right to know. First, I take this fluff, mix it with some chocobo feathers, and let it ferment. Once it's dry, I boil it all down. Then I squeeze it all out and voila, my patented choco tincture. That's some kind of magic medicine? Oh no, just a little fun. This wrinkly, cheeky old... Speaking of grass, if you've got some extra tufts on hand, would you mind sharing them with my assistant at the shop? I promise I'll make it worth your while. Please, tell me about my father. Hold your chocobo, son. There's still one thing you need to do for me first. What a surprise. This geezer isn't gonna tell you jack. Face it, kid. You've got a lot of nerve. Casting aspersions. After all the wisdom I've shared. All the what now? So you haven't realized you've been training this whole time? Tracking down Selena forced you to get in touch with a chocobo's feelings. And all that running across the water you did helped hone your sense of balance and your bird handling. Key skills for any aspiring jockey. What do you say, Cloud? Bet you feel like a real choco pro by now. Can't say I do. Sounds to me like you need more training. Reckon we ought to add one more item to your regimen. Think of it as a final trial of sorts. Oh, give me a break. Don't go changing the subject here, Gramps. We're not doing your stupid trial. No, it's fine. I'll do it. Then it's settled. I'll be your opponent. And dear Selena will be your steed. If Cloud wins, does that mean you'll finally tell me about my dad? You've got a deal. But know that I won't be pulling any punches out there. When you're ready, give me a holler and we can hit the track. I'm ready right now. Choco grass collector. Do I use this choco grass for anything? You got any choco grass for me? Thanks. Sure do. If you find any more, I'll be. Now, how about plumes? 35 tufts. Oh, you get like items. Okay, so we should probably collect more if we see them. Oh yeah, you could buy materials here. I completely forgot. Let me um let me get a few of these just because I have a lot of money that I'm not really using for anything. Trade some plumes. Saurian greaves. I like some of those. I know the sage is a bit of a handful, but stick with it, okay? It'll all this? Oh, this is like dressing up your chocobo? I don't really care about dressing it up. I only care about it when it's like the chocobo race. Alright, so we'll see if we can get more tufts. I'm not like promising we do that on screen, but it's um... It's something we can consider. If we see any tufts hanging around, we'll pick them up. Although we're done with Nibel's region, so I mean, it's kind of late for that, I feel. You prepared to undertake the final trial? I sure am. Zoom the chocobo. I get a chocobo armband. We'll do Sorian helmet, Sorian armor, or being Greaves. Yeah, why not? What can go wrong? Special race, zoom the chocobo. It's like two. Oh, it's X, isn't it? You hold X in this game, right? And R choose to drift. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I forgot how to play the chocobo game in my defense. Uh, honestly, can I redo? Let me retry. I forgot the controls for the chocobo game for a second. Holding X at the two, just like Mario Kart. Yeah, 
There we go. Better watch out for that. I really missed that. Are you kidding me? You scumbag. Oh, Choco Bubble? Oh, right, because we're using the blue one. I forgot each Choco Bubble is like a different ability. That's the way to go. Whoops. This is not going well. I mean, there's kind of a chance to catch up. What's Choco Bubble do? Oh, it like shoots a bubble. This is not going well. Like, at all. I need more dash or speed. Okay. I had a really bad start in the beginning and it kind of screwed me up. Um, also, this part, like, mega confused me. Oh, we're catching up. We're fine. Alright. Uh, the Chocobo Sage just sucks, I guess. Because I was able to catch up to him, no problem. There's a dash. That's what I really need to stay ahead of him. I'll hold on to it for now, though. Oh, my word. Of course. I have a dash ready, though. Dash. Don't get hit by that. Yeah, get bubbled, idiot. Go, my Chocobo, go! We gotta take another path that gets us to yellow. Keep ahead of him. Oh, wow. We're actually a lot ahead of him now. So maybe we're fine now. Yeah, we're good. I that got dicey for a minute. I win. Pluck my ever-loving feathers. That was one hell of a performance. If I didn't know better, I'd say this wasn't your first rodeo. Surprise. Well, shoot. You got me good. And once you start tearing up the track out there, the racing world will blame me for letting you loose. A promise is a promise, sir. Please tell me more about my dad and Uncle Sam. Hmm. All right, then. What do you want to know? Let's see. They couldn't have been much older than you are now. The two of them came and asked me to take them under my wing. Turned them down, seeing as I'd already retired. But they hung around the grounds anyway. Since they had nothing better to do, I put them to work. And that's how it all began. Imagine you, uh, there's <laughs> the whole thing about like, oh yeah, tell me about my father and Uncle Sam. Yeah, I don't want to know anything. That'd be funny. Well, wasn't nothing out of the ordinary, I'd say. Ran some errands, did some repairs, helped around the house. You know, your standard training regimen. And in their downtime, they took it upon themselves to dig through my library, learning about chocobos and how to handle them. Came to differing conclusions. They used to argue something fierce. I can't say the two of them got on terribly well. I figured. Will and Sam had mighty strong opinions about how to best raise chocobos, and it drove them to fight with their words and with their fists. That said, only reason those two fought as hard as they did is because they both cared deeply about the cause. As far as passion is concerned, the two of them were birds of a feather. Hmm, how you feel now? Managed to sort out the mess inside? Uh, uh, what do you mean? When we first met, I saw the way your eyes were brimming with anger. I knew right then and there that what you needed wasn't teaching or training. What you needed was time. Time to look deep inside yourself and clear out all the wickedness and spite that have been haunting your heart. Which is why you had him clean out the pool? Exactly. 
I don't know what happened to your father after he left this place. And I can understand why he'd want to beat old Sam in a race. Few things feel better than sticking it to someone who did you wrong. But that being said, you should never use your birds as tools for revenge. Ask yourself, why did I decide to start raising chocobos? I guess... I guess it's because I saw how happy those birds made my mom and dad. How they'd smile. The chocobos brought us a lot of fun, and brought us together as a family. I guess that's why. Good enough. The why is important, so don't forget yours. I reckon Sam's got his eyes on the gold cup. Keep yours unclouded by hatred, and you'll do fine. Thank you, sir. Thanks for everything. I'm gonna head back to the saucer, make sure our birds are ready for the big race. Don't worry about putting your name in. I'll take care of it. All you need to do is show up and win. <coughs> oh my word. <coughs> I drank my water the wrong way. Um, wrong pipe. Alright, so I assume there's gonna be a side quest for, um, for that. So that's really cool. So it'll probably be a side quest related to Billy and the Gold Cup or whatever. Cool, cool. I guess with that, we're done with the bell. So, I mean, like, the only thing to do, like, I mean, we have that one Gears and Gambits thing. And that one side quest. But other than that, I just want to move on to story. Most likely, we're going to move on to story till the point of no return. We'll see what happens, though, with that. Is there a bench here? I thought there'd be a bench here. You know what? We don't need a bench. I'm going to do this instead. I'm going to use items. But, um, alright, so, I mean, yeah, I want to move on the story next stream. We'll definitely move on the story. Probably just move on the story until the plane overturn is what I'm thinking. We'll see if that changes, but that's most likely what I'm going to do. And then we do everything and then finish the game. So, I mean, maybe we'll get the game done in, like, three to four streams. We'll see what happens with that. We might be able to get the playthrough done before 16. I don't know if there's going to be any kind of post game. I imagine post game might be like hard mode stuff, but we'll 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 see what happens. We'll we'll see if we don't get the game done before 16's DLC. It's not the biggest deal in the world, but it would be nice if I did. We'll kind of play it by ear and see what happens. But yeah, those of you watching, hope you all enjoyed. When we come back, we will talk to Sid and head back to the Gold Saucers, see where the story goes, and knock out any other unfinished business business before the Temple of the Ancients. So yeah, thank you all for watching. See you all next time.